So the tornado watch was lifted and now I'm at the at-home store to shop for my daughter's graduation. I also think that I'm going to be taking the week off from YouTube next week because that's just a very busy week for me from every angle. So I am at the at-home store and we are changing our game plan on how her high school table is going to look. So because of that, I'm redoing the whole thing. So we're actually going to do crate boxes. I'm going to try to find them here. So, but we're also going to string lights on our crate boxes. So I got these cute little mini round ones. They're, they come in a 50 count, but I'm getting two just in case. I don't want to find myself putting all this together and then thinking I need more lights. So I'm getting two. I'm obviously only going to open one and see if that's enough. If it is, then I'll return the other one. So that's where we're at. So I got the lights now I need to get the crates and then florals right there. So we're going to dive in there and we're looking for pastels, pastel orange and blues, and then just white. I love this store. Look, chili pepper lights. Wow. Love. So many cute. Look how cute all of these are. Little pineapples. Ooh. Look at those. Good morning. Well, okay, scratch that. It's actually almost one o'clock in the afternoon. And yes, I am just now eating breakfast. One, because I'm still doing the fasting thing, which I haven't really talked about my results. So I'll go ahead and talk about that next after this little intro piece. But I got up this morning and Loxy had Loxy had an accident because she went and ate a bunch of bread off the counter that she wasn't supposed to have eaten. It was a thing. The bread is usually kept back or in the pantry, so she's never gotten it since we've made those like changes. But I guess the bread had moved, and when I went jogging yesterday, she dove into like 10 bagels. So I guess sometime in the middle of the night, because I'd actually let her out at like 1 o'clock in the morning, I was up last night cleaning at like two o'clock in the morning. It was crazy. So at like one o'clock, I let her out. And then after I cleaned, I went to bed. And I guess sometime between then and when I woke up at eight, she had an accident. So I had to wake up and not had to wake up. I woke up and had to deal with that and cleaning the carpet. And then I had to go to Walmart, which I did a Walmart shop with me on for my main channel. Yeah, and so now, I've been kind of, you know, doing things, little things around the house and finally said to myself, I need to eat. What do I want to eat? I looked on Grubhub. I wasn't sure. So I just decided to make myself some pancakes. That's what I'm doing, watching a little I Love Lucy. So while I'm sitting here flipping pancakes, I could tell you guys an update on my fasting. I have to say that actually another person I've been talking to, so they started fasting as well, not on social media, just a friend I know. And she had mentioned she started fasting. I was like, that's interesting, so did I. So I guess it must be something that's kind of trending. Um, and and so I think it's been a little bit over a month, a month, a month and a couple of days for me. And I am five, five for reference. And I've always had this problem with being stuck at 138, but I also realized that really the number doesn't necessarily count because one, you have to take your height into consideration and two, if you're working out and you're building more muscle, which weighs more than fat, that could have a thing. So I'm trying not to pay attention to the number, but you almost can't help it. And just kind of expected myself to lose weight and I, I actually did. I, I went down as far as 134, but it's just kind of fluctuated now between 135 and 137. So I don't know how successful it was from 
a losing weight standpoint and maybe it was successful because I've also been working out at the gym a lot and gaining muscle like I said and I can tell I fit differently into my jeans so something there I have seen good progress is my point but it's really hard to say because I'm not a scientist I'm not into all this so I, I don't know other than just seeing myself in clothes and being able to kind of tell a difference. I definitely can tell a difference in my stomach. My stomach is a flat, not bloated, and I think that's because I'm not eating at, at night past seven o'clock is like my deadline, even though I'm doing 16, eight. Um, I guess technically I'm doing 12, 12, really not 12, 12, uh, 18, whatever. I don't know. I feel like I don't want to keep talking about this. Um, so anyway, I feel like it's been pretty good. I, ha I have liked it from the standpoint that I'm not letting myself eat past, past seven. That was a problem I had. And I did, I did allow myself to eat past seven on some days. And sometimes I messed up and had a snack at nine. Like that did happen. But it did not happen all the time. So that made me feel really proud of myself. Because eating at night is kind of like my kryptonite because I'm so busy during the day. I was I was in theory already fasting without knowing it because I wouldn't eat. Sometimes the first time I would eat in a day would be at like three o'clock. So, and then the problem would be that I would continue to eat until right before bedtime. So, um, yeah. I don't know if anybody would see res results if you weren't going to the gym so assuming that you weren't putting on any muscle but you wanted to just lose fat in general then you could probably use your weight as a guide to see if it's working but i don't know if you would see a difference in weight loss you would yeah i don't know just look up videos on how all that works because i'm just not educated enough to speak to it myself am i still gonna continue it i i am i like the idea of the health benefits and i like that i'm not eating late at night so but i do give myself cheats so like on the weekends at like nine o'clock in the morning i'll eat you know so um I'm not trying to make myself miserable by any means and i'm not miserable anyway waiting until like noon or one or whenever my start time is to eat I'm, I'm not miserable waiting for that to come around, so.